Good day and welcome back to another DB Legends video. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the battle Zenkai Rush, Zenkai Rush battle, sorry still used to calling it battle gauntlets, but we're going to take a look at the Zenkai Rush battle for the blue Belma. Now Zenkai Rush battle has replaced battle gauntlets for the near future, obvious future. And basically they are now 30 stages instead of 100, you get 300 Chrono Crystals instead of 700. But the format change is pretty good in the long run. Um, bit of a shame about the rewards, but it is what it is. Uh, you can get 3000 Z Awakening Power from this event. Uh, and yes, there are battle bonus characters, and those battle bonus characters will do increased damage and be able to help you out. Now, the best kind of team build to use here at least for me is going to be uh for me essentially you know the four yellow kind of sun family units so honestly speaking i'd probably say the yellow sun family build is kind of the best uh you've got pretty solid options there i think piccolo is pretty difficult to use because he's obviously yellow region yellow region zenkai uh, Master Roshi you could definitely use, and then obviously this new Master Roshi. But yeah, the Yellow Sun family is probably the best route to go, the best avenue towards success, one might say. So yeah, I would definitely say that's probably the best utilization of like the team or the best team that I could put together. Now, outside of that, uh, essentially, you know, to cut a long story short, what you can do with the rest of the Zenkai Rush battle is pretty straightforward. You just have to skip uh, as far as you can and then you gotta manually play the stages. Uh, that's realistically about it. There's not like a whole bunch of rocket science to it. There's not uh, a massive amount of you know, thought process or anything like that. Uh, you just basically wanna push and get to as far as you can through the auto battle system and then you're gonna have to manually play uh, all of the other stages which yeah it, it is what it is um, you should be more than fine to tackle it it's not a prestigiously hard uh, combat mechanic or fight or very mechanical fight so if we take a look at the yeah you know, like actual concept it's easy you can quick battle up to stage 25 so yeah hopefully that kind of works for you and then yeah obviously after stage 25, uh, you, you can just kind of manually battle from there. Of course, you might not get to stage 25, you might get to only stage 20 through auto battle like myself, uh, and that's also okay. You know, it's just gonna depend on what you, you know, feel like doing, etc., etc., or how good your team is. Uh, ways to improve your team, mainly gonna be, you know, things like, for example, making sure that you have good equipment, making sure that you have your units fully soul boosted, making sure that you are considering maybe arts boosting your characters, although that should definitely be last resort. Uh, most times the battles are fine. It's kind of like a hit a hard, get hit kind of process. The boss hits you hard, but you can hit them hard, so you should be okay. Shouldn't realistically be something that gives you a huge conundrum. Of course it can. Yeah, of course it can give you some big problems but for me uh, in general what I would say is I wouldn't worry too much about it I think for the most part you should be pretty good I think you should be pretty solid and yeah I think at the end of the day you should be realistically able to handle uh, the combat quite simply it's not distinctly difficult I think for the most part so yeah, give it your best go and then see how things go. But honestly speaking, the combat itself, it's not like hyperdimensional cop or raids or anything. There's no profound mechanisms towards it. You just basically need to do, you know, what you can. But that's it. Uh, and obviously you got to battle it out to stage 30. Uh, and then from there, you should have 3000 Zenkai power. There are no specific missions for this event. However, there are missions tied to some other events like Bulma's own Z Awakening missions and obviously some campaign missions that this event is tied to. So yeah, when you're completing it, go and take a look and check out for those. You'll find them under the event tab. But yeah, 
that's basically it we'll do another video to show you guys what i'm going to use for stage 30 but bye